friend says, uh, everything happens for a reason, man. You gonna deny that? Everything happens for a reason. Does everything happen? I understand cause and effect, sure. If I don't take my put my foot on the brake, if I accelerate, I might smash the car in front of me. I understand that, but is that what they mean? No. They usually mean like some cosmic, you know, someone's looking out for me, you know, everything happens for this grandiose reason, right? I, I, you've ever heard of a friend who's like, yeah, man, the other day I was getting out of my house, just running late, I was going to be late for work, everything was crazy, I was just scattered, I was running all the ways. I finally got to my car, realized I left my keys in the house. So I run back in, I grab my keys, I come back in, I get in my car, I get on the freeway, 50 car pile up, 20 people dead. If I had my keys, I'd have been in the middle of that, and I would have been dead. Somebody was looking out for me. Everything happens for a reason. Like, really? <laughs> like, if I'm God, I'm like, and I don't want you to die because, you know, the world really needs a solid Denny's waiter or whatever the fuck it is you do. <laughs> like, that's what I'm going to do, right? I'm going to hide your keys. As an all-loving, omnipotent God, that seems much easier than saying, I don't know, maybe don't cause a fucking 50-car pileup and murder 20 people. I don't know. Maybe that's me. Maybe I'm a different kind of omnipotent um, being. But, uh... <laughs> what about you? Yeah, I'm like, well, what about what about their reason? What about the 20 people? So maybe it's the other way around. Maybe 20 people died on the freeway because you fucking left your keys at home, you dick. How about that? 